All right, so chapter 21, uh, Jesus' entry in the, to, to, into the Jerusalem area for for the Passover and the Pasharach and Pashar and the the Pentecost and whatnot. Um, Passover and I, all these other religious, uh, religious, uh, religious uh, situations. Um, so, chapter twenty-one: the entry into Jerusalem. When they when they drew near Jerusalem and came to Bethage, on the Mount of Olives, Jesus sent two disciples, saying unto them, "Go to the village." Uh, opposite of you, and you immediately find an ass tethered, a donkey, an ass tethered to a colt, an ass tethered and a colt with her. Untie them and bring them here to me. And if anyone should say anything to you, reply, the master has need of them. They will, they, then he will send them at once. This happened, this happened so that, this happened so that what had been spoken through the prophet might be fulfilled. Um, say to daughter Zion, behold, your king comes to you, meek, and riding on an ass and a colt, and, and the foil of a beast of burden. Ah, uh, beast of burden. The disciples went and did as Jesus ordered him. Uh, they brought the ass and the colt and laid the cloaks over him, over them, and he sat upon them. The very set upon them. The disciples went and did as Jesus had ordered them. They brought the ass and colt and laid over their cloaks over them as he sat upon them. He, the very large crowds, the, the very large crowd spread their cloaks on the road while others cut branches from the trees and sewed them and sewed them and strewed them upon the road. The crowd preceded them, and those saying, those following Jesus, or those following, kept crying, saying, "Hosanna to the Son of David! Blessed he is who he who comes in the name of the Lord! Hosanna in the highest!" So the crowds are are, are happy that Jesus entered uh, on the, on a donkey. Um, And when he entered, and when he entered Jerusalem, the whole city had shaken, and asked, "Who is this?" And the crowds replied, "This is Jesus, the prophet from Nazareth in, Gal in Galilee, the cleansing of the temple." Oh, and when he entered Jerusalem, the whole city was shaken, shaken, and asked, and replied, "This is Jesus, the prophet." Uh, from Nazareth in Galilee. Twelve, the, the cleansing of the temple, and he said, "And he entered the temple area and drove out all those engaged in selling and buying there. He overturned the tables of the money changers and the seats of those who are selling doves. Uh, he overturned the tables of the money changers and the seats of, so, of those who are selling doves. And he said to them, "It is written, My house is, my house shall be a house of prayer." But you're making it a den of thieves. A den of thieves. The blind and the lame approached him in the temple area, and he cured them. When the chief priests and scribes saw the wondrous things he was doing, the children and the children crying out in the temple area, Hosanna, a son of David! They were indig they were indignant. And said unto him, and said unto him, uh, and, said, and said to him, Do you hear what they are saying? Jesus said to them, Yes. Have you never read the text? Out of the mouths of infants and nursings you have brought forth praise? And leaving them, he went out of the city to be to Bethany. And, they, and there he spent the night. The cursing of the fig tree. The cursing of the fig tree. Uh, when he was going back to the city of, in the morning, he was hungry. Seeing a fig tree by the side of the road, he went over over to it, but found nothing on it except leaves. Then he said to it, May no fruit ever come from you again. 
and immediately the fig tree withered. Uh, fig tree withered. Uh, when the disciples saw this, they were amazed and said, how was it that the fig tree withered immediately? Jesus said to them and replied, Amen, I, Amen, I say to you, if you have faith and do not waver, not only will you do what has been done in the fig tree, but even if you say to this mount, to these mountains, this mountain, be lifted and be thrown into the sea, it will be done. Whatever you ask in prayer, whatever you ask for in prayer, in faith, you will receive. The authority of Jesus. The authority of Jesus questioned. When he had come to the temple area, the chief priests and elders of the people approached him as he was teaching and said, "By what authority are you doing these things, and who gave you this authority?" Jesus replied, said to them in reply. Jesus said to them in reply, "I shall ask you one question, and if you answer it for me, then, then I shall tell you." By what authority do I do these things? Where was John's baptism from? Was it of heavenly or human origin? And he will say to us, Why do you then not believe him? Uh, 26. Uh, 26. But if we say of human origin, we fear the crowd. For they are all regard John. They all regard John as a prophet. They all regarded John as prophet. Regard John as prophet. So they said to Jesus in reply, "We did not know he himself." What the? So John's prophet. So they said to Jesus, Jesus in reply, "We did not know he 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 himself said so." Said to them, "Neither shall I tell you these. Neither shall I tell." You what by what authority I do these things? Wait, wait, wait. We, we, so they said to Jesus, we don't know. They said unto him, Neither shall I tell you by what authority I do these things. 28. The parable of the two sons. Here's Jesus is teaching also in during this whole Passover, Passover time, too. The parable of the two sons. What is your opinion? A man said, a man had. What is your opinion? A man had two sons. He came out. He came to the first and said, "Son, go out and work in the vineyard today." He said in reply, "I will not." But afterwards, he changed his mind and went. Then the son came. Then the son, other son, gave the. Then came the man came to the other son and gave the same order. Um, gave the same order. He said in reply, "Yes, sir, but I do not go." From which of the two did fathers did the father's will? They answered the first. Jesus said to them, Amen, I say to you, tax collectors and prostitutes are entering the kingdom of God before you. Hmm? Was, which of the, the first? I mean, amen, I say unto you, the tax collectors and prostitutes are entering the kingdom of God before you. Um, when John came to you, in the way when John came to you in the way of righteousness when John came to you in the way of righteousness, you did not believe him, but the tax collectors and prostitutes did. Even yet even when you saw that you did not change later change your minds and believed him. Here another parable The Parable of the Tenants. Here another parable. There was a landowner who planted a vineyard. He put a hedge around it and dug a wine press in it. He built a tower. Then he leased it to tenants who went on a journey. When when the village when the vintage time when the vintage time drew near, he sent out the servant the servants to the tenants to obtain the produce. But the tenants seized the servants, and and one they beat another. And one they beat, another they killed, and a third they stoned. Again he sent other servants, more numerous than the first ones. Uh, <clears throat> but they treated them the same way. Finally, he sent his son. He sent his son. Uh, finally, he sent his son um, to them, thinking they will respect my son. 
But the tenants saw the son, and they said to another, This is the this is the heir. Come, let us kill him and acquire his inheritance. They seized him, threw him out of the vineyard, and killed him. What will what will the owner of the vineyard do to those tenants when he comes? They answered him, What? Uh, what will the owner of the vineyard do to those tenure tenants when he comes? They answered him, He will put the wretched men, um, He will put the wretched men uh, to a wretched death and lease his vineyard to the other tenants who will give him the produce at the proper times. Jesus said to him, Did you ever read the Did you ever read in the scriptures? Um, the stone, the the scriptures, the stone that the builders rejected has become the cornerstone by the Lord. By the Lord has this uh another 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 riddle. The stone that the builders rejected has become the stone, the cornerstone by the Lord has this done, and it is wonderful in our eyes. Mm. Therefore I say unto you, the kingdom of God will be taken away from you and given to people that will produce its fruit. The one who falls from the, the one who falls on the stone will be dashed to pieces, and it will it will crush anyone crush anyone who it falls on it from whom it falls. When the chief when the chief priests and Pharisees heard this parables, they knew he, uh, he was speaking about them. And although they were attempting to arrest him, they feared the crowds, for they regarded him as a prophet. Chapter 22. So more, 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 more speaking to the prophets, more speaking to the Pharisees. Uh, he's in Jerusalem right now. I know he's at, I don't know, Bethany or Bethany or some, some, some place. Uh, okay, so we'll go, we'll, we'll, we'll go to chapter 22.